in my way as in comes Bid now. And there's a bit of width, and this is driven through the offside. This is a beautiful shot there from Parkinson. He frees his hands through the offside. Palmer to Dernley, round the wicket, comes down the track, lofts over the top of mid on. And it is going to go all the way down to the boundary. It goes just enough over the ropes as well, actually. Umpire signalled. Harmer is in. Again, Denny takes a couple of steps down and he's hit that one through the leg side and that's gone all the way for four runs. Similar area to where he's just... Harmer over the wicket to Parkinson, who's down to sweep. Replaced in a moment as Critchley bowls to Parkinson. He's lofted that one up, a full toss, and driven away. And that's going to go for four as well. So Parkinson with... Boundaries and back-to-back -back overs. Moves to, to 35 and back. Harmer oh, back over the wicket to Parkinson. Short leg and a slip. Orthodox field goes for the slog sweep. And it's gone for four. Let's come back into our view. Harmer around the wicket. Denley comes down the pitch and pumps him over that fielder's head. All the way for six. Is into Denley, oh, he gets low for that lovely drive through the covers. That's going to go all the way to the boundary. Is the longer boundary, but he's bisected the fielders. It's a four for Joe Denley, and that brings up his 50 as well from 106 balls. Here's Porter now over the wicket to Parkinson, who's forward. Well, this is kind of nip back at him, and the finger goes up. That is him done. Porter's absolutely hit the nail here with that delivery and Parkinson is going to have to depart in again to Joe Denley Denley drives that one straight back past Snater and that's going to come all the way to the boundary just in front of us for four runs most of them are electronic these days it feels like beer bowls always oh, flashed by Finch over the top of Gully in comes Porter now and this time Denley opens the face of the bat runs us down towards third and they'll pick up more than a couple. has gone all the way down to the boundary, crosses the rope. I'm thinking, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm ready for some more. You're ready for the drama yeah. as Harmer is into Finch, who whips that one into the leg side and away over the square leg boundary for four. Yeah, that was a really nice shot from Harry Finch. Full delivery on leg stump. Despite all those leg side fielders, this is going to go for four because Denley has managed to tickle it really fine. All looped up by... Critchley and it's a low full toss in the end that Finch has drilled away for four really nicely played sometimes not always as easy as it looks the four from the first ball of Harmer's over he's in again to Finch he's going to take a shuffle down a aggressive slap back past Harmer and Harry Finch is taking this on another four runs back to back fours in <laughs> comes Critchley shows a one pulled back through to mid wicket and it's not gone all the way it has the gone all the way the boundary there's a misfield and umpire signals four to the scorer that adds four to the total and in comes Critchley now and this time use of the feet he tries to go big but this time doesn't get it and he's hit this straight into the hands of mid on Joe Denley what have you done you've been batting so well use his feet didn't quite get enough on it and he's been hit straight to mid on you couldn't have asked for a more simple catch of this county championship match as Harmer is into Everson who decides to go for the sweep and successfully so because he's got it away for four runs as Harmer is into Finch who plays that one nicely through the offside he's going to get four runs of no chance of that being stopped by Jamie Porter who was chasing after it and Kent move themselves on to 297 for six. Have a net to see if how much pain he was in with the shoulders. That was an outside edge from Finch and it goes down towards third man all the way to the boundary. He's down on his back. As Finch tickles this one down towards fine leg. It might go for four. It will. And Finch will get his 50 as well. Beard short ball, which Finch pulls for four. Really nicely played. Got on top of the bounce. Pulled away by Everson in the air, but safely over the head of the fielder at mid-wicket, and it will go away eventually on the ground for four runs. Beard bowls. 
Another short ball. Finch pulls it more convincingly this time because he's even beaten the two fielders in the deep and got four more runs. So it seems unlikely that he'd make a, an appearance again tomorrow. Critchley into Everson, who's down on his knee and gets that one away nicely for four runs. Yeah, a little bit of a drag down from Critchley, that one. Very strange, though, that that's the case as Wesley bowls. Oh, to Finch. Everson tries to get out of the way before he gets clobbered. Thankfully, from Kent's point of view, he does. As Critchley is in to Finch. And that one will go all the way for four. Found the gap this time. Mid-wicket. Short leg and a slip. The two closer catchers. Oh, and he's got him. Joey Everson's gone for the sweep. And completely missed it. Tom Wesley gets him out bold. Wesley's in again, and Finch goes to play this off the back foot, and his finger's gone up! There's an appeal, and he has gone trapped. Oh, he smacked that, though. That's gone into the leg side, and possibly big, and all the way. Yeah, that was very big from Grant Stewart. Comes in from the pavilion end, Arafat's forward, and it's a play. He's bowled him! Arafat leans into it. He really tries to play that outside his body reach. And Critchley's gone in there. Bails are off. Sahama bowls. Stewart has smashed this down the ground. And that is surely going for six. That is an absolute whopper of a hit. Stewart, has, rather than go for the single, has absolutely walloped that fifth ball of the over. Here comes Harmer again. This one's going to be four more. It was a low full toss. And Stewart has just flat batted it through mid off. So he ends the over by taking 10 runs off it. Harmer's now 31 overs, none for 111. <laughs> it's Critchley in now, and you can hear it. The finger goes up. They've trapped. Where's Agar? And Critchley, well, he gets his fifth. 